We are already here with the second to last episode of our JoJo's Bizarre Adventure and it looks like our final trip will be on board a submarine. Which does get me extremely worried as we are travelling with Joseph and I just don't like anything that goes along with travelling and Joseph. And considering it's the final kind of leg of the journey for us to reach Egypt, I feel like something really funky, chaotic, yet weirdly fun is going to go down. Also, we have Abdul back, so yeah, well, welcome back, he's back guys. So like, we have a whole gang again, so I guess, yeah, let's see what the frick is gonna happen. If you guys wanna synchronize your video, I'll be standing at two minutes and 10 seconds, or else you can click the link above to watch the full anime, where I'll be standing the video in three, two, one, go. Hi, Priestess, part one. The most beautiful sea in the world. It does look quite mesmerizing. I'm also loving like the little bit of geography we get to learn. Wow. We're starting off very like, oh, oh, oh okay. Now you're saying no problem. No. No. Yeah, I'm not getting into another crash with cuts of you. I'm on a submarine. Really? By rich people for pleasure? Can't relate. That was so BB. <laughs> Welcome back. I feel like we're definitely going to spot something on that, aren't we? It's kind of like how every, every submarine horror kind of starts out. Oh, well, you jinxed yourself already there. That's what I was saying. Like, it's already threatening enough that we're traveling, I think, on a submarine. But I think there's just that more lingering threat at the sense that we are under 60 meters underwater. What do you mean by you've barely moved? Is this not... Joseph? Important and delicate. This isn't like Joseph. Oh, New York! Who are you calling? Who would it possibly be? I'm trying to think. Your waifu? Uh huh. Uh huh. Is this? Oh, this is. This is. Um. Um. Oh, what's her name? Um. 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 Oh, I forgot her name. It's cause I'm under it. I'm at a hotel. Smooth. <laughs> I love our Joseph Quarter's waifu. Susie! That's her name. I think. Something along those lines. I don't know. It was Susie. Oh, okay. She says she caught a cold. Uh huh. She'll be fine soon. It's very important. Ah, oh. I see, I see, I see.
I simply must ask you something. I can't decide between a white dress and a purple dress, okay? <laughs> That's nice. I gotta go in for the save. I still appreciate the fact. I appreciate it so much. Just I get seeing like kind of our OG characters as well as Jason calling his waifu. Learn our outward clothes. Oh, Holly. Holly. But wouldn't that just worry her more because Joseph, it means that Joseph is also going off on. Yeah, I feel like she'll just worry. This house is absolutely lavishing. I pray for your safe return. I really appreciated this scene. Joseph's not going to make it, is he? I don't know. I think, um, I don't know. Any character that has like, a, oh, I'll return. Don't worry. And like, doesn't tell Susie anything. I'm used to these deaths. Like, oh, did he just... Jean focus, Jesus. No. Oh, good job. Good job. <laughs> Adul has changed so much. That's weird, but I do quite like it. And it does make sense because he literally nearly died, so. Mm -hmm. Why are you cheating my boy Kakuin like a maid? Jeez. We're like in the middle of nowhere, aren't we? There was a cloud. Oh! <gasps> Africa's visible. So far, I'm having like a really pleasant journey and I'm really confused. Ooh, no, let's not go there. Okay. We finally made it to Egypt. Are we going to defeat Zia in one episode? Or <laughs> I don't think so, is it? <laughs> it's been a long time since the five of us were together. I guess that's kind of the mood. It's just quite nice everything has been just really lovely so far you know where did the six cards come from didn't he count exactly five? <gasps> oh, hello oh no no the f <gasps> Joseph wasn't gonna make it was he The fuck are you? Oh, you are nasty little shit. Oh, it's so fast. Oh! In a way, it's... It 
it's a bit like the whole ship incident again. But this time I think it's more like an individual... Oh, we're so close to Egypt. <gasps> Joseph! Oh no, it's gonna be Susie. Focus. Hi, Priestess. Nita. So she's likely on the surface. It is quite small. It's kind of like that lover's one again where any kind of mini. So it could be anything at any moment. I guess it only, it does rule out the fact, oh, it's just going to start slowly destroying the submarine that we're in. We're so screwed. Wait, maybe it's in the phone. It, it... <laughs> okay, no, it was Susie. Rose! You're in a rowdy hotel. Yeah, things are about to get real rowdy. Oh no, this is going to worry her unnecessarily. Why did Joseph pick up the goddamn phone? Okay, I guess... No, what the, what the fuck, Ginger? I will grant. Okay, I guess that's kind of really cool. Okay. Jojo's cool. I admit. Jojo plays off things really cool. Wait, who the fuck said the oh my god? I think it was John. Every vehicle we ride in gets destroyed. Preach it. <laughs> Never again will I ride in a submarine. This isn't where we end, surely. It's quite, oh, it is weird, isn't it? This, this episode brought something quite new with this kind of back and forth um, phone call, I feel. Yeah, the submarine kind of crashed. Don't worry, though, I hope. They're just having some grandfather, grandson bonding time. Are our boys fit enough to swim 60 meters up to the top? I'm gonna go with no. But can it keep moving around? I don't think punching it's going to really solve anything. <gasps> no, it's the, it's the, it's the. Why is she so slippery? It's so, it's, it's... You're a fast little fucker. Can it just like keep, like, it's... This one's a tricky one to deal with, because...
it's a bit like the ship one, you know, where the ship could also kind of move in, like, um, do oh, hello. Why are you so mad? Yeah, and it, but it's so quick. Like, I feel like there were certain limitations to the ship one, and at least we could defeat the stand user of that perverted orangutan. Move! Oh, we got it, we got it. Nothing can be faster than stop that now. Pop it! <laughs> Wait. What's happening? It turned into a razor. Such but oh, at least Joseph's all right. So whilst it was being squished, it turned into a razor, so it flicked a pain on us instead. But are we in trouble? Yes. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Grant. No. No. Okay. I just don't feel like we should be setting fire within the submarine. Oh, it hardens as well. It definitely has an immense amount of experience in battle, doesn't it? To be so able to instantaneously react to like any kind of fighting style. Jojo's mad. And this laughter is driving me insane. We'll personally beat you to death. Should I, we be a bit... <laughs> You're the what to my wife? <laughs> I mean, yeah, I feel like... I do feel like him answering the phone did worry her, like, for no reason. <gasps> it's time for one of Joseph's brilliant plans. Of course you have. I'm quite excited to see kind of OG Joseph, you know, smart, witty Joseph. Let's see what kind of play he has in mind. They're just having a bonding moment. That's good. Wild. Look at her smile. What turned him into such an asshole? <laughs> mm. Oh, that was upsetting, but quite quite the beautifully animated scene. Oh, nice boy on transition scene there. I like that how it kind of like faded out from the city into the ocean. Yeah, we're not in like any open space either. Like we're all surrounded by materials. We're 40 meters below sea. Yeah, how do you guys plan out? Do you, do you have a mini? Oh, we're going to swim. Why do I have a feeling that it's turned into one of the... <laughs> mm, oh, Joseph. Let me hide. There's shit to a given by Jojo. 
Okay, I'm glad we had scuba equipment. I guess that kind of gives me hope. Oh, are we going to have like underwater battles again? That would be neat. Why, 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 why was the mouse so freaking big? Quite the troublesome and annoying kind of stand user we are facing off. I am quite impressed by the stand user themselves. I could definitely see like their experience in battle just with how quick they can kind of transform and like how quickly they can think of new kind of situations to fight against our boys. Like I think it is quite an impressive user to be able to instantaneously think about becoming a razor so they wouldn't become squished. Cause yeah, I was quite surprised when we actually captured the stand. I was like, oh, sweet like that that's it we can either just tie it up or we can like just pop it and we'll be fine but yeah um for a stand user to retaliate like that by turning into a razor was very impressive and then to deal with jean it hardens itself by using the materials of the submarine and that's why silver chariot had absolutely no effects on it so that was another kind of quick impressive move i don't know if it was because of the submarine but also i guess the phone calls kind of to susie but this episode definitely kind of gave a different vibe and just like could get a sense that we are near towards like kind of the season finale not only are we facing off with an impressive stand user but i think it's just the fact like joseph kind of calling his wife telling her like everything's fine and not kind of like showing her the dangerous situation they really are in it gave a very ominous vibe i don't know if that's like a death flag i am very sensitive about all the death flags now so that does get me a little worried and i guess that might have been like that ominous kind of death flag just lingering in my thought that really brought that sense of kind of like danger to this episode and i also think it's because the first kind of like tennis minutes like the first kind of section of this episode was really just beautiful like mellowed out we had some kind of like smooth softer like calmer tones to everything and you know we were just exploring the really beautiful fishies and we had kind of like abdul back as well so i guess that brought on more of like kind of a cheerful mode and just like the counting of the five cups even though it ended up being that a six cups suddenly appear but i still just like the fact that we still had like five of our members back so i guess that was the whole vibe of like abdul being back as well Abdul's change yet there was like kind of soft mellow vibes going on but then we also had kind of this ominous feeling of being in the submarine not knowing when the sand user was suddenly going to pop up so yeah now I'm really looking forward to this kind of underwater battle I think that is about to go down so on that note make sure you guys say awesome and let us jump straight into episode 24.